enemy! Here goes. And push! Jesse! God damn it! God damn you! God damn you all! It was us. We did this. No. You can't think like that. Whatever came before, it was Shinra that pulled the trigger today. Am I right? This anger, okay? <sighs> Barrett, Marlene's fine. Huh? Aerith found her. Aerith. Is that the girl they took? Yeah. That's her. Hmm. What the hell's going on? I asked Aerith to find Marlene and take her somewhere safe. <sighs> and she did? You sure? <sighs> hey! Where are you going? How could this When is help going to arrive? This wasn't an accident. I said, where you going? Aerith's house. It's in the Sector 5 slums. And that's where Marlene is? Where we hope she is. Tell me she is. Give me something to hang on to. Even if she's not, I won't blame you for it, I swear. Who am I kidding? I'd probably try to tear your head off. Hey, Tifa, know anything about ancients? I know I've heard of them, at least. They come up in planetology books. Meant to be the original stewards of the planet. Could even commune with it, talk to it and stuff. That must be why the Turks wanted her so badly. With 
Within my veins flows the blood of ancients. This planet is my birthright. <sighs> Failed again, I see. But through suffering, you will grow strong. Isn't that what you want? It's nothing. Let's go. It's like there's a hole in the sky. Whoa, someone forgot Wait, to play? Wait, over, the over there. What the hell are they doing here? Their jobs, probably. Mm. Just focus on seeing Marlene again. Nothing else. Legit paralyzed for fear. I'm serious. She... <laughs> that hundreds of people are still trapped under the rubble. Is it true that Sector 7's pretty much destroyed? You guys run into Jesse at Bella. Yeah, Biggs too. They were both in pretty Let me bad through, shape. Let me but oh Wedge God, wasn't up there with them. He got out. All right. Come on now. There's no need to be afraid. I've been oh. thinking, y'all. We gotta go find the others. If we don't look for them, who will? Uh, right. Hey, Cloud, gonna need your help with it, too. Right. My ears are still ringing from it. It wasn't me. This is Sector 5, right? So where's this place you said Marlene is? Where I think she is. It's a house on the other side of town. Hmm. Well, come on then. Pick up the pace. I'm going as fast as you are. I can't uh -huh. even imagine how it looks over there. And now, Anywhere we're going to go. Still safe? No car is in the morning. Bottom of the class of the Sector 7 case. City officials are currently restricting access to emergency responders. There was this rumbling, and then all of a sudden... That's the house. Marlene! Marlene! Marlene, is she here? Barrett. <sighs> Sorry, I'm Barrett. Marlene's my little girl. Marlene, she's got short hair. She's cute as a button with the heart of an angel. She was wearing, uh, pink. She was wearing a she's pink dress today. Upstairs. Huh? Oh. <laughs> I said she's sleeping. Uh. Mm. 
I want to see her too. Come on, let's go look in on her. Keep it down, don't wake her. Marlene, my baby, thank God. Shinra has my daughter now. I'm sorry. No, I'm the one who asked her to go get Marlene. We'd only just met, but she was so kind and helpful. I took advantage of her. It's not your fault. It was only a matter of time before she ended up back there. Because she's an ancient. Is that it? So she told you about that. She must trust you all a great deal. Yes, Aerith is an ancient. Probably the last one living. She's not my daughter. Not by blood, I mean. If that's what you were wondering. <sighs> About 15 years ago. My husband, he'd been shipped off to fight on the front lines. But then I received a letter saying he'd be home for a bit. So when the day came, I went to the station to meet him. But he didn't come. I couldn't help fearing the worst, even then. But I told myself his leave must have been postponed, that he'd been delayed. Every day I went to wait and to pray. And that's how I met her, her and her mother. I thought maybe they'd run away from Wall Market, or that they were topsiders fallen on hard times. I'd seen that sort of thing a lot. Take Aerith somewhere safe. Those were her mother's dying words. My husband had been away for so long, and I was lonely. So I convinced myself the safest place for the girl was with me. It took no time at all for her to start feeling like family. She was a real chatterbox. She told me strange stories. Like how she and her mother had escaped from some sort of facility. And how she wasn't sad because her mother had just returned to their planet. Their planet, huh? Yeah, that sounds about right. <sighs> I didn't understand any of it at the time. When I asked if she meant one in the sky, she said no. This one, right here. I mean... What can you say to that? Mommy, don't be sad. That's what she said to me one day, out of the blue. So I asked her, what's wrong? A man you really, really loved just died. His heart came a long way to say goodbye. But he couldn't stay because he had to return to the planet. I didn't believe her, of course. And then, a few days later, 
I received a letter saying my husband had been killed in action. Things like that. She'd just know. It was a lot to deal with, but we were happy. <laughs> and then came the uh, knock. Uh, coming! <laughs> no! Go away! Hmm. Aerith, you know you're not just any little girl. You're a descendant of the Ancients. I had no idea what he meant, so I said, who are the Ancients? They were the original stewards of the planet, whose boundless knowledge and wisdom shall guide us to the Promised Land. <clears throat> Some believe the Promised Land to be a myth, others an allegory of sorts. But we take the words of the scriptures at face value and believe it to be quite real. Which is why Shinra would like very much for Aerith to help You're us- You're wrong! I'm not an ancient! <sighs> but Aerith, even when you're all alone, don't you hear voices whispering secrets? No, never! <clears throat> but all three of us knew that wasn't true. That man knew exactly who Aerith was, where she'd come from, and what she could do. They knew where she was, but they didn't just take her? Doesn't sound like the Turks I know. She had to come willingly, otherwise it wouldn't work, they said. That's why, even if they did take her away, I'm sure she's still being treated like a guest. And that they'll send her straight back home, once they get what they need. I doubt it. You're not planning anything, are you? Don't make things worse than they already are. If I lost her, too, I don't know if I could... if I could ever... Just don't. Cloud, maybe she's right about this. Maybe they'll let Aerith go when it's all over. Maybe we'd be better off waiting a little while. Let's head back to Sector 7. Got things to take care of. Like checking up on the bar. Yeah. Okay. You're alive! Still in one piece? Who else made it out? I wish I knew. Sorry. Oh, it's fine. I'm just glad you survived. Gives me hope for the others. This is bad. <sighs> we can't afford to lose any more lives. Not now. Damn it. This is bad.
see what's on the other side. Finally, I can use some fresh air. Damn it! I still can't believe this happened. Listen, sector six is right over there. We just need to walk a little bit longer, that's all. That one was a lot closer. The house was pretty old. And it's Hello! Is there anyone out there that needs some help? My God. Just a little more. Come on. Come on. It won't budge. Make room. Mara, you're alive. With me. Ready? And... Great job, guys. Thank you. I can't tell you how relieved I am to see you. So, what now? Don't know. Find something, anything to do. Been back to the bar yet? No. Maybe you should go take a look? <sighs> hmm. Okay. First the bar, then the rest. Careful. The roads are a mess. Watch your step or you'll wind up in a hole. Hello! Anybody out there? Anybody if you can hear there? me, say something! We're hey. here to help! Hey. Can you, you can hear, hear us? Me. Can you hear me? Anyone there? Hey! Hey! Tifa. Get back! Ah. Shit! Hear that? That's Wedge's cat. What? Let's follow it. Ready? One, two, three! Is this all that's left of Wedge's place? Hey! We're coming down! Stay right where you are! <laughs> this place reeks of Shinra. 
Tifa! Cloud! Shout if you can hear me! Hey! If there's no path, you gotta make one. Wedge, hang in there. Must be a secret Shinra facility. Ain't got nothing on me! You really want to throw down with me? with me? How long it take him to build all this beneath our feet? Man, you'd think they dug halfway to hell. Not going down without a fight. Want some more? Asshole! a little drowsy. He's okay. You sure? Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
making me worry like that. I kicked your ass if you didn't look like shit. Thank God. Thank you. Okay, let's go. Uh, sure. It's you, all right. What is this? Barrett! <clears throat> the hell is this now? Are they Shinra experiments? <laughs> well, if that's the case, then it's only right we put... Time, Merc. You're up. Late to the party, and you giving me orders? How'd you manage to track us down? Followed the trail of bullet holes. There's nobody else I know who'd leave that kind of mess. Oh, God. Were those... People? Yeah. That's the Shinra I know. We need to get him somewhere safe. Everything else can wait until after. Agreed. Let's go. Cloud. Good kitty. A 
I want you to take Wedge back for me. I'm gonna look around for the others. He made it, didn't he? They could still be alive. I saw them both at the pillar. Jesse and Biggs. Saw how bad they were hurt. I'm sorry, but... Don't. They've returned to the planet. They... They were supposed to return to us. We stop now. They'll never let us live it down. <clears throat> so, we carry that weight. I'm sorry. I truly am. We had no other place to go, and... I would never leave a wounded man out on the street. <clears throat> Omira, I know what you said, but you have to let us go after Eric. Not this again. We found an underground Shinra lab, where they've done human testing. This wasn't the first time, and it won't be the last. I know these people, and I know they're never gonna let Aerith go. She's the last living ancient on the planet. Think about what that means to Shinra scientists. Especially to that son of a bitch, Hojo. We're all just numbers and meat Enough! to him. But... <sighs> Please, I need some time to think. You've all had a long day. Why don't you go upstairs and get some rest? Can't sleep? No. You too? I heard footsteps. Sorry. Didn't mean to wake you. I'm a light sleeper. It's a soldier thing. <laughs> that flower you gave me the other night? That was from Aerith, wasn't it? I knew there was something weird going on. You buying flowers? They symbolize reunion, believe it or not. I was curious, so I looked it up. I tried to keep it alive as long as I could. But now, it's dead and buried. <sighs> like the bar. 
our home and everything else. <laughs> they took everything from us again. You're hurting me. Uh. <sighs> it's stupid. I know that crying's a waste of time. That's not true. <clears throat> Thank you. You've done more for us than we deserve. I won't forget this. If you ever need anything, all you gotta do is holler. Happy to help out, however I can. Elmira. I've been thinking about what you said. She's calling out to me. I can feel it. We all can. So please... She's our friend. We have to help her. Mm -hmm. I always knew it was coming. Knew that one day I'd have to say goodbye to my baby girl. But not yet. <clears throat> Please, bring her back to me. Marlene. Are you going? Uh, I'm sorry, honey. I wish I didn't have to. I wish I could be with you all the time. I really do. But if I stay here, I can't fight out there. Some bad people are trying to hurt the planet. And Daddy, Daddy and his friends are trying to stop those bad people. The slums, your friends, the whole planet. It's Daddy's job to protect it. Hmm? And that's why I've got to go. You remember that nice girl who came to find you? Well, now we have to go find her. And when we bring her home, you need to say thank you, okay? Okay. That girl, she was kind of... <sighs> what? Nothing. You should help her. We will. You'll come back, right? Of course, I promise. <sighs> okay, you can go. <clears throat> Barrett. She's tougher than me. All right, time to get some payback. Don't forget why we're doing this. I know, I know, to rescue Aerith. 